As you can imagine, there's a lot of flexibility with the final result. You can tweak so many of the parameters we go over in this course to really make it unique to you and make it your specific shot. That's the goal here is to not just show you what buttons to press, but really give you an idea of just what's possible so that you can have more tools in your tool belt and go out and make something awesome. So uh, this is what our 3D scene will look like in 3D space. You can see we're gonna start with a piece of footage with this live action house. We're gonna reconstruct a low poly version of that in 3D space so that we can have a proper shadow and also light casting onto our footage so that it mimics the real world light. We're also going to break up the piece of the roof using the cell fracture add-on and create a destruction simulation using rigid bodies. We're going to import a 3D UFO asset that's included in this course. We're gonna do a little bit of animating for that. And then we're also gonna build out the attic interior and combine all this together in our compositor. We've got a lot of nodes, but in the end, you should have something that looks kind of like this before your color grading. So. That's where we're going with this course. Like I said, this is meant to put you in the driver's seat of visual effects and just what all is possible inside of Blender. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. So let's, uh, without further ado, jump into the first course, which is gonna be reconstructing this house in kind of a low poly manner so that we can get the shadows and light cast onto our footage.